Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and a few questions popped up, a few questions um, since I posted my video yesterday about Microsoft doing a lot of useless things to change here and there, little, you know, minor uh, things in Windows 10 and you're wondering why. But uh, also some of you come with some questions about the end of support. So one of them was about uh, the bug fixing updates. So when we, of course, go to uh, the updates, there are two major updates a month for Windows. So the one is the bug fixes, the um, security fixes, which is Patch Tuesday. And that is the second Tuesday of every month. And of course, they, uh, these are mandatory. You have to install them. Then you have the preview updates that they're called and a lot of people get a little um, kind of surprised at these updates because the because of the name update preview there is an impression that those are not finished updates well the kind of finished updates but Microsoft has this weird way of you know uh, calling things uh, and these are the bug fixes that are on the fourth week of the month and um, the question was, is there a time in, before the end of support next year where the preview updates that arrive uh, on the fourth week will stop? Uh, probably. Uh, usually what happens with a operating system that's getting um, end of support roughly six months before end of support, the preview updates stop. Bug fixing updates don't happen anymore. So. I would expect that by the summer of 2025, we will probably not have any more of these preview updates for Windows 10. They'll only be on Windows 11. So um, that is probably going to happen. I'm, I, every operating system as of yet that worked this way have been um, that uh, it has stopped several months before. Another uh, question that came, and um, here's the, the, the thing about it, and the question is, I don't want to have preview updates. I just want to have the security updates. Is there a way to do that? Well, no, because of the name, cumulative. These updates add up. So if that update is missing, it's going to be installed with the next update after it because it has to be there in order for Windows to continue the updates. So you can't say no to the to the uh, update preview or the bug fixes. In reality, even though they call it optional, it's optional only for a week or two. It's optional until Patch Tuesday, because then it becomes mandatory, because Patch Tuesday cannot install without the bug fixing updates, because they're cumulative, they add up. So um, that's the big problem. Um, there are updates that are uh, not cumulative. And uh, one is the famous update that bugged everybody in January. Uh, the uh, KB5034441, for example. They called it a simple security update for Windows. So there's no cumulative word in it. That means that update is a lonely update. It's its own thing. It doesn't add up to the Windows uh, updates, which means you can stop that update. And actually, when it was buggy, everybody, um, you know, I, I told, I showed everybody how to hide it, uh, and the updates continued like, you know, there's, it's okay, it's fine, because it was not part of the cumulative chain. It was not part of the adding up to everything else. It was a very separate update, and they intentionally did it like that. To make sure, because they knew there was a problem, they intentionally did it like that to make sure that, well, if it doesn't work or if you decide to uh, hide it, well, you know, your PC is not going to be bogged down by that update that can't go or continue. So that's pretty much what's going to happen. And uh, once the uh, the last question I've seen is about, well, paid support for the uh, security updates. How is it going to work? Well, it's, you know, probably linked to a Microsoft account. So those that will pay will probably have to have a Microsoft account and your Windows 10 operating system will probably continue getting the Patch Tuesday updates like they do right now 
as long as you have paid for the extended support. And that's going to be the same way. There's not going to be anything to do. Uh, you paid, and Windows will know that it's a paid uh, service, and it will continue just getting patched Tuesday updates. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.